So, we decided that we're gonna put this vlog before the rest due to the fact is that we wait three hours for it. So, Black Tap, you get an exclusive. And then to explain what it is, here's Casey. Uh, is this the place for the crazy milkshakes? This is it. I want your biggest, best milkshake. Okay, so see that line over there? That's the first line. You go around the corner, that's the second line. You get on the end of the line, five hours. Is this the milkshake line? Yeah. yeah. It, it goes all the way around the corner. Okay. <laughs> is this is this the milkshake line? Yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! Are, is, are you guys in line for milkshakes? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I want you! Hi. How are you? Hi. Hi. Nice What's to meet you. Oh, Jerome! <laughs> <laughs> <What's that? laughs> is this the milkshake line? Yeah. Is this the back of the milkshake line? Yeah. Sweet and uh, salty. Right here. And then your cotton candy. Willy Wonka on steroids, boys. Thanks a lot. Jerome, you sure you don't want? I'm sure. You want a pretzel, Jerome? No. So yeah, we waited four hours for milkshake. It was actually three hours for milkshake, but in total, we waited about four hours, didn't it? Yeah, probably. In about total four hours. Course, yeah. But um, yeah, so here's the vlog. Start spreading the news I'm leaving today I want to be a part of it New York, New York Start spreading the news So me and John decided to come to oh. Stat is it called Staten Island? Staten Island. Yeah, we come to Staten Island and then uh, here's the view. It's uh, Manhattan. So we uh, took the uh, drone out. Successful flight. Well, kind of. Eventually. It took about an hour for it to get fucking connected to the fucking compass shit. But once we got it sorted, we spoke to one guy, he gave us some advice. We were going to fly through this big thing over here. That's the memorial for the 9 11 for people that live on this island. We didn't know that though but prior we didn't know to that. speaking to him. So I was going to fly through it and then go so you can see the Manhattan skyline. And then I was like, nice, no, disrespectful. So we just walked a couple of meters down and did it from there. Got some sick footage. We got some wicked selfiness as well. <laughs> so that ultimate New York selfie that was. Watch when we put that up. Stupidest way to try your hands ever. Hands out like that, <laughs> and then the water just trickles down your sleeve. <laughs> What's that about? So we just got stopped because my bag, my drone bag's huge, and the woman was really nice though. But I would, like we, me and John were just saying, we'd rather them check people with big bags than people not being checked. So she's really nice though. She's cool, but then everyone, everyone here seems to be cool anyway. So yeah, police officers cool, everyone's just cool. That man's just flying drones. No one gives a shit, lad. <laughs> Start spreading the news. So we come to the 9-11 uh, memorial. Massive, right? We didn't expect it to be this huge, it's really big. And it's really, it's really weird. Like the big what like, obviously what happened. And like the new trade center. Yeah. Huge, massive. We're just trying to work out. Obviously, we think this. We don't even know. It's really bad. That we don't know this, but we think that this is the spot for one of the towers. Yeah, this is definitely one of the spots for the towers. But the other one, I'm not too sure. So we're trying to find out where the other one was. There, and we couldn't work out where the other one was. The other tower. And we just found this map, so we're just going to walk around the museum. See the North Pole. This place is huge. It's like crazy how big. We're just trying to work it out, but yeah, so we're here. 
and we've still got the other tower pool to go to as well. And then, Me and John just went into the uh, <coughs> St. Paul's Chapel. It's the uh, church where, where it was literally next to the Twin, twin Towers, when it fell, like, obviously it's still standing. And then um, all the uh, firefighters and rescue helpers were here to uh, arrested here when they uh, <coughs> were still searching for bodies and stuff. It's actually quite like surreal, surreal, isn't it? It's mad. Not surreal. And it's all like the actual work, like the firefighters' jackets, like all melted away from all the fire, like their boots. Crazy. But here it is here, look. Basically, I've dragged James down to Soho because I've seen this place called Black Tap NYC and the sickest milkshakes ever. They do all food and burgers and all that stuff like that, but mainly I'm here because I want one of their badass milkshakes. And when we get in there, eventually, hopefully, we'll get in there. But look at the queue, it's massive. Yeah. And the queue goes all around the corner. But it'll be worth it. Wait until you see, see the milkshake. Apparently, though, it's normally a four hour, four hour wait of it. Yeah, yeah. That's two hours, so. See if we make it. Man's gonna get boiled out. Mm -hmm. I'm like, this is boring. Like. <laughs> Literally just having a conversation about how much shit we've eaten, but I, I personally feel like it's bad as it's so bad. It's a lot of shit. This is not that much. A couple of burgers, yeah. You know I mean, a couple of burgers. <laughs> Times out by five or six. For a day, that. Seven. Bro, oh, well, world time. Ten, isn't it? Yeah. Decided that Vegas is a waste of time. Not, not they went a waste of time, but it's good to do it, obviously, but not a huge fan. LA and New York for me, hashtag winning. Super. Don't know. It's waiting. Not moving. One. We should give you a time and update as well. Check out one. <laughs> so, what time is it? Now it's uh, just coming up to 6 o'clock. Yeah, look at this, look. It's had about putting on weight or whatever. Can we just walk in? Look at all that, it's all gone green. Green, look. Set for Wednesday. So we're in <laughs> Vegas. There's <laughs> no walk in. Just <laughs> dying. Some new friends. Oh boy. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs>
So we made it into uh, Black Tap, yeah, that's what it's called. I can't remember what it's fucking called. I know I waited two hours to get there. But yeah, sick so far. Awesome. Two hour wait, hopefully it's worth it. From what I've seen, them, them milkshakes look absolutely dope. I did see them prior, but actually coming in here and actually looking at them physically, look even better. And the thing is, I'm starving so much, I'm gonna order some food as well, because I'm hungry. We're gonna be, we're gonna be getting them sides on too, brother. Sad. We just left. What's it fucking called? Black Tap. Black Tap. NYC. NYC. Literally, we're not at dinner. We just had a couple of onion rings and some uh, sweet potato fries. And now we're like, after the shake, literally like, that could be your dinner, innit? Yeah, I'm not joking. I'm but stuffed. We had this nice little American couple. Just have a little chat and that. They're sweet as well, so they're gonna be in the vlog. Christian, I see ya. We see ya! <laughs> but um, yeah, definitely go back there again. Like, definitely, like, that is a sick spot to go to. And the inside, like, the atmosphere and, like, um, it's the vibe, isn't it? Like, it's the music. It's pretty cool. They play, like, uh, old school hip hop and stuff like that. So, I don't know. It's just. Because it's a bar as well. So you can get booze there. But they do, like, um, good for, like, food and obviously the shakes are the best things out there. It's just dope, man. Like, it's just, it like... It's worth queuing up for. Even the staff are nice, aren't they? Like, yeah, pretty cool. The girl outside's a bit of a dickhead. But, like, <laughs> she's like, you can wait half an hour, two hours later. Just chatting somewhere. So, but the guy, the main guy, we've seen that the main guy, he was yeah, cool, yeah, innit? He was right. just, like, sweet. So, yeah, man. Loved it, bruv. It was well, worth, got to say it was that, worth the three hours, three, it worked out to, 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 to the minute we got the shake from the start to the end, it was three hours, so it was worth it. But any of you lucky bastards that go in about two weeks time, they're opening downstairs and there's going to be like 50 seats, because at the moment there's only 15 seats, that's why there's always a queue. Exclusiveness. To be fair though, the queue is normally this long. 
Go to Casey's video. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> However, our queue is half of what it normally is. So we got a bit lucky to. So look at this, sick. Oh, we should do vlog there, look. Natural light. Oh yeah, in front of it like that, <laughs> isn't it? Bro, do you even know where we're going? I'm literally, yeah. I'm literally being well mugged off right there. This guy told me, yeah, we'll go Brooklyn Bridge, get some shots. Now he's like, oh, I just go home, man. I'm tired, man. So I got bumped, took three hours to get a milkshake, and now I can't even fucking do what I want to do. This guy. It's worth it though, weren't it, obviously? It's better worth it, man. That's all them fatty things, though, you get me? <laughs> No, 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 I'm going to speak to her. Right, give me one second. Put it on line one. Press line one. Line two, line two, line two. No, no, press line two because it'll take you up hold. Hello? Hello? Hi, hi, hi. Um, is is there is there is there any way you can check the system? Obviously, I know it's not late at night at the moment, but is there any way you could check to see if there's any rooms available for tonight so that obviously they'll be free tomorrow? Yeah, because for example, if they're free tonight, that means there'll be no one staying there, so that means we'll know if we can get into a room earlier or not. No, all I'm asking is the fact is that if there was if the room was empty tonight, that means it'll be free tomorrow. So that means there'll be no one inside the room. So it, do you know how many rooms there are free tonight? Or okay. So would we be better off to just call in the morning and say obviously we're going to come to the hotel because we're waiting for a connecting flight. That's all it is. We're just waiting for a connecting flight. So we don't really want to uh, walk around the streets. That's correct, yeah. So we get into Boston. What time do we get into Boston, James? 9am. We get into Boston at 9am and what it is is we've got a connecting... Oh, is that okay? Because I mean, the only reason I'm asking, just to give you a bit of background, is um, basically we, we... It's for two people. Uh, we was looking, uh, actually we were just looking for one room, um, uh, a King Double if you have, a, have that available. King Studios. Is there? And say to him, is there any time for their breakfast that morning? Yeah, you see Miranda, they just <laughs> breakfast, but we'll be leaving Alright, okay, cool, no, that sounds fine. Because right. um, what it is, is we, we've, we've got a connecting flight later on that evening at 9 o'clock, so really we just want a place to, to put our luggage and obviously just, just the rest and chill out until our flight in the evening. So if we could check in. Uh, yeah, I know, unfortunately, it's just a connecting flight back into London, so. Um, I mean, if it is possible to, uh, obviously, yeah, book. Yeah. Is it really? Yeah. It's, that the really it's the cold. It's the cold. I'll just pass you on to my um, friend James. Um, hopefully, I can try and make a reservation over the phone. Is that okay? Can we make a reservation over the phone? Or Um, yeah, if you give me two seconds, I'm just going to quickly speak to my friend. I'm just going to place you on hold, it won't be a moment. Thank you. She, speak to her. She's basically saying that we can check in from 5 bro, in the morning. Yeah, 5 a.m. If we wanted to, but I would say book it through her. And the only reason that I'm saying that is uh, if you book it through there, I don't know whether they're going to say, like, I don't know. Bro, I'm telling you that, that's got 45% discount. <laughs> discount? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, 44% off, original price £210. Well, ask what the price is then. 
Christ.